Retail theft is on the rise across the country and here at home, and now investigators believe an organized theft group is responsible for several robberies at cosmetic stores like Sephora. The L.A. County Sheriff's Department says women in this ring are using booster skirts to steal thousands of dollars in merchandise. Mary Beth McDade is live in Studio City with a look at how they're doing it. Mary Beth. Hello there, you guys. Yes, uh, we are told that these two women have been identified as being part of a Romanian theft ring. And detectives say that not only are groups like this involved in ripping off retailers, they're also involved in other scams and identity theft. Watch as two women are captured by security cameras entering a Sephora store on Cross Creek Road in Malibu last month and allegedly packing thousands of dollars worth of cosmetics inside one woman's black booster skirt. Detectives say these skirts, which have a loose elastic waistband to easily drop items into, are often used in these types of thefts. Investigators are hoping someone can help identify these women who they say are part of a Romanian theft group. We have it considered as an organized crime group. We have several units from different stations uh, assigned to these uh, to these thefts, and we're trying to figure out if there's a rhyme or reason as to how they're conducting their crime. The Romanian theft ring is known to target several retailers in and around L.A. County and across the country. In September, Pasadena police busted this group who tried to conceal merchandise by hiding behind each other. In the San Diego area in November, crime ring members hit a Sephora store twice. Retail theft security officers in both instances helped catch some of the suspects. We've seen them in other parts of not just the United States and other states, but we've seen them in other countries such as Mexico. So what do they do with the stolen goods? We can only guess that these items are either being taken back to their country of origin or they're being sold online to individuals who are actually buying it, especially right now during the holiday season. They they steal these items and they sell them for cheaper val or they sell them for cheaper prices. Investigators are trying to figure out if all the groups are related or working as individuals. We know it's a heavy hit for these stores, which is why we're working tirelessly to figure out who these people are, how they're working, who's operating, and take them into custody. And authorities say that the two women involved in that Malibu case, they took off in a 2011 black Toyota Sienna minivan. Of course, if you know anything about these women, you are urged, urged to contact authorities. For now, reporting live here in Studio City, Mary Beth McDade, we'll send it back to you guys in the studio. All right, Mary Beth, thank you. A check of